Here in lesson 3 we will learn how to boot from the DVD. To boot from the DVD, your computer will have to recognize the DVD as a bootable application. Oftentimes computers do this automatically. Starting the PC with a bootable CD or DVD in the drive invokes the corresponding bootloader. We will begin by following a short step-by-step -step method. Step number 1. Turn on the computer. Step 2. Place the DVD into the CD-DVD tray in your computer. Step 3. Turn off your computer. Step 4. Restart the computer with the DVD still in the CD-DVD drive. If the computer cannot find the DVD, you can change the boot order via the BIOS. To get to the BIOS, the computer must be turned off. And follow these steps if you have a Windows computer. Step number one, start up the computer. After starting the computer, immediately press either the Escape, Delete, F2, or F12 function buttons depending on your computer. Powering up my PC with the DVD in the tray, I was able to hit the F2 button to bring up the boot unloader. And using the function keys that were located on the bottom of the screen, I was able to navigate, get to my legacy, and then from there, I was able to change the boot settings and put my CD DVD into the first position. Upon doing so, I was able to now start that Tails DVD. So there you have it, there is the Tails Anonymous Browser. In our next episode, I'll get an internet connection, we'll go online, and we'll look at some of the features, functions, and benefits of using the Tails Anonymous Browser.